folks, this is Zay Automotive Reviews, and today we have here the 2021 Tesla Roadster. Now this car is going to be an amazing $200,000. Now the original Tesla Roadster put all the electric auto makers on the map. Even if the Model S and the Model X, the Model S and the Model X, they both sound the same, so sort of weird saying them. Buyers don't remember it. S slated to make a return in 2021. The second generation Roadster bests its predecessor by adding two small rear seats, significantly more driving range, and much higher level of performance. Now, Tesla CEO Elon Musk boasted about the 1.9 second 60 mile per hour time and the 250 miles per hour top speed. Now, when the Roadster concept was unveiled back in 2017, figures was very much hope will prove accurate when this sporty car finally arrives. What's new for 2021? The 2021 Roadster will be a new addition to the uh, Tesla lineup. With it into production, resurrecting the nameplate worn by the company first model back in 2008. In case you guys didn't know, that model is also in space someplace. Now the pricing for this car is going to be $200,000. And the founder series it's going to be an amazing $250,000. Tesla claims it will offer the base roadster for $200,000 and a limited edition founder series for $50,000 more. There's no details on the on the different what differentiates, excuse me, between the two other than the fact that only 1,000 founder series models will be built. If you're a collector, perhaps it's worth the extra dough. Uh, this story will be updated soon when more information is obtained. But as far as we know about the engine and transmission, when the 2021 Tesla Roadster was unveiled as a concept back in 2017, uh, the founder Elon Musk touted some pie in the sky performance numbers for this car, including a 60 miles per hour of 1.9 seconds. A top speed of more than 250 miles per hour in a quarter mile time of 8.8 .8 seconds. That's outrageous. Now if the 60 miles per hour time hold up it will mean the Roadster is a full second quicker than its key rival the gasoline powered 570S. Also during the uh, conference must note it that the Roadster will come with a standard all-wheel drive. This is less surprising. Now, Tesla mainstream EV models utilize two electric motors, one at the front and one in the rear, to drive all four wheels. So it makes sense we will see the same setup in the Roadster, but we'll be waiting to see on that one. Now, the 200 kilowatt battery is said to provide up to 620 miles of range. Nothing can compete with that, folks. Nothing at all in the automotive industry can compete with that. But certainly that number will be achievable only under very light uses. Heating the track for some flat out hot laps won't come back with those kind of figures. But look at this design, folks. Look at this. I mean, this is just amazing. I mean, if you got $200,000 sitting around, are you ready to sign those papers for that $200,000 payment? This electric car will be the one to get. This just looks awesome from every angle. Now, as far as fuel economy, the EPA hasn't released its ratings for the Roadster fuel economy, but those details are surely merged closer to the car's on sale date. Now, we hope to have a chance to test the new Roadster and um, check out Car and Driver for that. And um, they hope to be taking this baby down on a 200 mile highway uh, just to see what the fuel economy is all about. Now, what an impressive sports car. It is just so nice. Just look at that. What a great presence. Let's look at some interior pics. Beautiful. And that's the car getting up to is a test at 1.9 seconds up to 60. What an amazing view and amazing angles. 
Now, the 2021 roster is a concept and changes can happen uh, during the development into the production model. Now the roaster uh, concept features a movable glass panel roof which you can um, stow in the trunk. It has four seats but the rear ones look as though um, they may not fit adults but you can probably fit a baby seat back there, throw your groceries back there, or when you're going to pick up some grub from a restaurant just throw it back there. Now, the car has a, a dramatically angled roof line because it's a sports car. Other than that, you expect the Tesla seen a uh, minimalist interior design to be repeated here. And as you can see, it looks beautiful and gorgeous, folks. Now, infotainment and connectivity. Now, in a concept design, a large screen, as you can see here, extends from the top of the dash all the way to the center console with a cubby underneath it for storage. Now no vehicle in Tesla lineup offers uh, services such as Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, or Amazon Alexa compatibility. And we don't expect uh, that to change with the uh, Roadster. In fact, the infotainment system in the Model 3 sedan is any indication of what we'll see in the Roadster. Buyers shouldn't expect to find an AM radio or Sirius XM in this car. Uh, we think it's likely that Tesla will provide an onboard Wi-Fi hotspot, a Spotify integration, and a host of visual and entertainment apps such as Netflix, Hulu, and YouTube to keep driver entertained when parked and when your spouse is out shopping and buying her Louis Vuitton shoes. Now as far as safety and driver assistance systems, since the roadster is still a concept, uh, the National Highway Traffic and, and Administration uh, Insurance Institute for haven't come to any testing yet, but we expect Tesla to offer um, all the latest, greatest driver assistant technologies, uh, including uh, their famous autopilot, uh, semi-autonomous driving system, and um, now as far as standard automated, they'll have the car will have standard automated uh, automated braking with pedestrian detection. And we expect a standard lane departure warning and uh, with lane keeping assist. Also an available adaptive cruise control with a semi-autonomous driving mode. Now the warranty. Uh, now we can anticipate the Roadster to offer um, the standard warranty package as on the rest of the Tesla lineup. Which include 8 year warranty on the car's electric motors and battery pack. Uh, and which is a much much different than his rivals, such as the Audi, the Porsche, Taycan. Uh, the Tesla is not likely to come in with the complimentary uh, scheduled maintenance. Again, like we said earlier, uh, a limited warranty covers uh, 50,000 miles. A powertrain warranty covers eight years, regardless of miles. Uh, and again, no complimentary scheduled maintenance on this baby. Now, this car is spectacular. We don't know if this steering wheel right here is going to go into production. I mean, this is going to be a regular steering wheel. I don't think they let you have steering wheels like this in the United States. And I'm sure it'll barely be rectangular, and it'll probably come across here for you to for you to turn. That's the closest I've seen, but I've never seen a, like an F1 inspired steering wheel on the, automo on the automobiles here in the United States. I mean, even the exterior of the uh, Tesla Roadster is also minimalistic in its aerodynamic design. And you see the curves and the concaves here. And hopefully this right here is functional. Um, the battery charging system, let's see if we have any pics of that. Um, if we can see that. If anything, if we can't see it, chances are it must be located here, if not here somewhere. Let's just take a look, and that's the car just moving down, moving down the highway. What awesome! I mean, this awesome style and pizzazz, and that front, that front end is just masculine in the way it looks. It is such a high tech, a high tech car you know, on the cutting edge of technology. Now, if you get that uh, extra fifty thousand dollars, the founder's package, you know, I would go ahead and, and 
to spin that because that's the one that's going to appreciate because there's only there's not going to be too many of those models now the Tesla the Tesla Roadster is an awesome car and 2021 this baby will be coming out there'll be so much news about it it's going to be hype and um it would be great to be a part of that hype and it'd be great to foot out that two hundred thousand dollars for that now this car is also planned to be the world's fastest car now either a mound of provocative uh, belly who are galactic nut kick to the uh, gas fed hypercars either way this car is gorgeous with wheels sprawled to the corners as we talked about earlier this design is just awesome I mean and just the outer skin of this car is just tight now Elon Musk is prone at making big claims for this car um, he has a lot of confidence in his roadster and they plan on rolling this baby out in 2021 now with this car 1.9 to 60 it's going to beat the Conasig, the Ajero RS uh, now the Ajero RS top speed record of 277 miles per hour which is now different the Bugatti topped that by 304 the Chiron now Tesla I'm sure he's probably looking at that but uh, electric cars aren't known to be super super fast like with top speeds but this one is planned to be at 250 miles per hour right out the box and that's the base model so boy oh boy what the founder what the founder package is gonna be like now the roaster isn't a roaster at all but a targa uh, which means the top comes off that glass roof is removable beyond that we know only that it has four seats and he calls it a two I mean Elon Musk calls it a two plus two car so basically you don't count on moving four dots just like the Porsche uh, 911 uh, Turbo S I mean it's not gonna have the kind of seat you know the the room in there for that um for, full grown adults now the competitions the McLaren BP 23 Mercedes AMG Project 1 Porsche Mission E um, and whatever uh, other um, amazing hypercar that we see out there especially during the time when this one is introduced now the people that own this car this car is destined to live up to Elon Musk's claims and sometimes this has been a problem for Tesla you know with their expectations but Elon Musk will work overnight to try to make it happen uh, but the one thing about this car above all the other cars it's gonna have that range and I believe it's gonna I mean right now I think they're at the 400 mile mile range as far as the distance but getting a 620 if anybody can do it it's Elon Musk that can do that um, better than anybody else can Audi uh, Porsche I mean he's way 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 ahead so that's 620 uh, mile range you know it's not gonna come using those top speeds though but it's definitely definitely gonna happen I mean it's just an amazing car if you got it consider yourself blessed again this is the uh, 2021 Tesla Roadster and it's definitely prone to be the world's fastest car there's nothing out there that's like it folks nothing now we all know that this car as as you know as considering um, uh, as of May the 8th this car is scheduled to come out in 2022 not 2021 so we're gonna have to sit and wait for this car I um, mean to come out so with all these things going on um, and what's happening in the world as far as with the pandemic um, there's gonna be a wait for this car 
Now the second generation of Roadster is celebrated by Tesla as the quickest car in the world and has been delayed according to Elon Musk. It was expected to arrive in 2020 and later on after that it was expected to arrive in 2021. Uh, Musk broke the news uh, during his second appearance on Joe Roger Experience podcast. He explained that the next roadster likely won't see the light uh, that awaits at the end of the production line until the Cybertruck and the semi deliveries begin. Uh, the former has been penciled in by 2021 launch. Uh, though some versions won't be available until 2022, while the semi program that has also seen its fair share of delays will arrive next next year. So the executive uh, Elon Musk didn't explain why developing the roadster uh, will take approximately two years longer than an expected. Tesla has a long history of delaying its vehicle launches for various reasons, but it surprised the public and the press by starting production for the Model Y. Um, the fourth member of its current range, and the Model Y is awesome, and it's and it's got that long distance. I believe it's 400 plus as far as um, the electric charge will last you that long. And so you can imagine what's going to be in place for the Roadster. When it finally does arrive, the second generation Roadster will stand out as one of the most impressive series produced electric cars ever launched. Now, Tesla quoted 620 miles like we talked about earlier in the video. Um, but we'll see if we can get to that. Um, and Tesla doesn't do cheap so we all know what the price is and we all know what's expected but this is a Tesla Roadster folks and this is AO Automotive Reviews thanks for watching remember like share and subscribe if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up share it with your friends and subscribe for more interesting videos